Hello and welcome back, I am Arumba. thank you for joining me, let's play some more RimWorld with Yoshizor... Yoshizor's Sly, Taze, Scumbag, and the Girthy, Wallace. Looks like the bear has finally dead. It's finally dead. D-E-D, -E -D, dead. Dude, Yoshizor's, you are a beast! Look at him, just picking up the whole freaking bear? No big deal. Um, I thought I read that bears were, like, really heavy. Are they not? Can I not see more information about the bear? Uh, show me the bear? I could have sworn I read that the bear was like a really, really big animal. It's gotta be at least as big as like a muffalo, right? I mean, I mean that's, that's pretty heavy. Shouldn't he have to like chop off the legs and arms and like carry them piece by piece? I mean, he's supposed to be able to carry 75. Anyway, uh, Sly's a bit hurt. Do appreciate the comments on episode number one. It sounds like what had happened with the, um... The construction thing was that, uh, yeah, we have one of the mods enabled that allows us to say we want a specific quality setting, and because that was enabled, only the best person with the highest crafting skill was allowed to build. Something like that, basically. So, um, next time if we need to build a whole bunch of beds at once, we'll just turn that quality feature off, and, uh, hopefully they'll, they'll get to work on it. So, Mr. The Girthy is, uh, resting now, apparently. It's a big bear. Now that it's dropped, I can see more information about it. The Grizzly Bear Corpse weighs... 150.5 kilograms. So you're saying you cheated, Yoshizor. You carried twice your body weight. That's not cool. Okay, so do we still have our minor break? Unroofed 145. Unroofed 145. What does is, what is one, 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 145 mean? One, 145. It's 145? Okay. It's 145. Obviously. Alright, how are we doing on happiness overall? Scumbag. Currently has, um, uh, it's pretty happy. It's pretty happy, yeah. Shared bedroom, yeah. But you'll get, you're gonna get your own bedroom soon, don't worry. Uh, Yoshizor is the one that they we're really the most concerned about. Greedy for an impressive bedroom. I really, I want a really impressive bedroom. Well, soon, okay? You're gonna start to slow the game down as it gets close to 6 a.m. Uh, let's cycle through, see how everyone's rest is looking. It's pretty good. Uh, basically when the first person gets to about 100%, I think we're gonna wake everyone up. Especially if they're sleeping in a barrack, you know, I don't want them to disturb each other. I'd rather that they just get up. Need defenses? Ah, Defenses? No, no, it's actually correct. We do need defenses. Chad Dukes? Dude, don't open doors. Alright, that's close enough. Everyone except for Sly, it's time for you to get up. Wake up. I'm sorry, Sly. Didn't mean to disturb you. Okay, so who's the doctor? We got a doctor person. Let me guess, it's Sly, right? No, it's Yoshizor. Alright, so you're well rested. First thing you're gonna do is go and treat Sly. Uh, let's make sure we've got our medicine disabled. Because we don't want to waste any herbal medicine on somebody like that. I don't think herbal medicine is very valuable. A pack of herbal concoctions typically extracted from the heel root plan, plant. Less potent than industrial pharmaceuticals, but much better than nothing. I mean, let's see just exactly how bad this injury is. You've got a teeth bite and a scratch from the bear's front left paw. Your torso is at 18 out of 40. Needs tending now. But it says you're in no immediate danger. Consciousness is barely even weakened. You're just in a lot of pain. So, you're saying it's, it's a little bit worse than the, uh, the Revenant. No, it's not as bad as the Revenant. Prioritize cleaning blood of Sly. No, uh, let's treat Sly, but let's, um... We're gonna forbid the medicine. Nah, just kidding. It's just herbal medicine. We can get more, right? Sure, we can get some more. How's Sly doing? Bandage, bandage Sly up. First off, I gotta get this straight. Sly is a female. Okay, got it. Scratch, grizzly bear, front left paw, quality 51%. Okay. That seems pretty good. And the bite was quality 40%. So she's treated. She's not gonna die, she's gonna be fine. Don't worry about it. Probably shouldn't have gotten her injured in the first place, but you know. Mr. Scumbag here, deciding to butcher a small innocent rabbit instead of the big huge monstrous bear that mangled his friend, because... Oh, no, there he goes. Also, he sees eye to eye with Taze. He says... I'm gonna... I'm gonna butcher the shit out of this bear. How do you like me now? We gotta do something with all this meat before it spoils. It spoils in less than a day. We gotta do something with the alpaca meat. Let's forbid this other meat for a moment. Um... And, uh, we're gonna have to start refrigerating some of this meat. 
Dude, that is a lot of freaking bear meat. Jesus. Okay, um... Let's see. Our cooking location was here. Making pemmican. I don't think we can afford to make pemmican right now. We're gonna suspend that. We're gonna add just a temporary manual build to cook a simple meal. And just say, do forever. Uh, and just hope that we can use up this alpaca meat. I mean, we murdered an entire alpaca. We're crying out loud. We need to do something with it. Then again, how long is the alpaca meat gonna last? Mr. The Girthy. Sly, you need to get better. I need somebody to do some work. Well, we do have the option to build a few things. There is uh, a thing called a... Not an ice gathering station. It is a... It's not a misc. It's not a marriage spot. Trade reports printer. No, that, that's not gonna do it. Uh, we need to build this um, passive cooler. Made out of wood. A traditional unpowered cooler that works by water evaporation will run out of, and self-destruct after several days. Well, you know what? Several days is better than none days, so yeah, that sounds good. While Sly's sleeping, why don't we find a, a bed that's not completely awful. Awful, awful, awful. Shoddy. Which one's worse? Shoddy or awful? Rest effectiveness 90%, 85%, and shoddy. So we got two shoddy beds. Let's go ahead and relocate this one into here. Uh, we gotta prioritize getting that wall done. Mr. The Girthy, you're gonna get reinstalled over here as well. Sly's not using her bed, but this is a bad one, you know, like I'd, I'd like to uh, try building a new one. Um, let's build them a little bit closer since we know that uh, that's what's going on. So this is the, the quality build thing, unset building for skillful workers. So I know it, I've used this before, right? Like you right click and then you say normal and then they keep rebuilding it over and over and over again until they actually get it to at least normal quality. What we're going to do, I guess, is just turn off the quality build so that anyone will build them because everyone sucks. <laughs> They're all god awful. At building things, so come on, let's not be let's not be surprised when they're shoddy, horrible beds. Okay, so he took ten meat and he made what? What, what? what do you have on you? Simple meal, carrying simple meal. How many? You, where did it go? I swear, I just heard you made the sound effect that like you put it down. No, no, he still got it in his inventory. A simple meal quickly cooked from a few ingredients. Uh, deterioration rate, 20 per day. The rate at which this item deteriorates when left outside, especially in the rain. Well, it's not outside, it's in your inventory, so I'm assuming that means it's not going to deteriorate. Yeah, I think it's- I think we're better off just taking the, uh, the alpaca meat. And I'm starting to get the, the hang of this here. Nutrition, 0.05. So one alpaca meat's worth 0.05. And the simple meal, uh, recipe takes 0.5 so it should take yeah 10 10 meat 10 raw food of any kind equals one simple meal so if we cook the alpaca meat first then we can preserve some of that that poor body it's like scumbag is putting down some equipment here finish that wall that interior wall please good job scumbag appreciate your uh your generous efforts. Let's get, uh, let's go ahead and get Scumbag's bed moved in. And Taze's bed can get moved in as well. Their, their stalls. Their, uh, their locations where they get to, to die. We need to create something. I, I've been reading about this. There's something called a kill corridor. We need one of those. So, we're gonna unforbid this whole wall. I'm gonna get everything walled in soon and now. Um, and then we're gonna have to create some traps, right? So... It's gonna be a... not a structure, not, not production, it's gonna be security. Deadfall trap. It's a lot of wood, suspended spiked weight held up by a delicate trigger. When the victim disturbs the trigger, the weight is released and falls on his head or torso. You can also build a shallow moat, light perimeter defense to slow down the enemy. Can be dug on diggable terrain and kid can be removed with the remove floor tool. So, yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna basically like create a series of deadfall traps along a path. And I understand that deadfall traps can hurt your own characters, so apparently the, 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 the way to manage it is you go like deadfall trap, deadfall trap, and then nothing. And then you put like a door on either side, and then that way they can, they can walk between it and access the deadfall trap without having to like walk through the kill zone. So we'll, we'll do like a whole series of those like that and see kind of how it goes. Now I am a little bit terrified to find out that it's, it's entirely possible with this... Uh, tribal start that the bad guys that show up are going to have 
uh, real guns while we have pointy sticks. So that's fun. Uh, we only have two alpaca meat, which is why he stopped the task. Well, now that that's all done, let's go ahead and just use up the bear meat. If we are... Um... Well, now, where, you made one more. Where'd the other simple meal go? Did someone else pick it up? I assume. Someone's got berries on them. Simple meal, simple meal. Yeah, somebody else picked it up already. I guess they like to carry, carry extra food around, don't they? Well, since we're completing this wall, I do think that it, it might be a good idea to have a temporary wood stockpile. We want... not food. Uh, raw resources... wood. Priority preferred. Go. Mr. The Girthy here, getting along with people. Good to see Yoshi's horse cleaning up the dirt on the on the dirt. And the blood. Blood in the dirt. <laughs> that's, that's very high priority activity here. Taze is doing essential colony management at Wooden Basic Manager's desk. And scumbags back to the cooking. How goes Sly? 24 out of 40 health. I mean, is this like, like, okay. This is not life-threatening, right? And it's pat- I mean, we, we got it taken care of. You're on bed rest right now, right? Let's see. I- yeah, you don't need to be in bed. Get- get out of bed. I prioritized her going to bed. You don't need to be in bed anymore. Wake up. Get- get to work. This is an awful bed. Uh, okay, so let's- let's assign these beds. Yoshi's or Bedroom quality, awful. Skill 7. 5, 6, 5, 5. So Yoshizor, the jealous one, you get the best bedroom with quality, awful. Nice. Uh, beyond that, let's just make sure everyone does get a own their own room. So we will set owner. Uh, we'll say Sly. And then we will go to Taze. Scumbag. And the Girthy. And then these beds are... Pretty much just trash. Um, I am gonna go ahead and say to deconstruct them both. Because they are... They are literally awful. No one should sleep in them. It's not a very high priority task. Um, but we could recoup some of the material and use that material to build more... More places to sit, more walls, more whatever, you know? So Sly's up and about. A little bit of... A little bit of blood on her skirt. Sorry about that. I mean, I really feel quite bad. Teeth, 6.2. 8.13. How often do you heal? Do you heal, like, on a daily basis? On an hourly basis? Like, how, how exactly is health calculated, I wonder? Okay, um, we're gonna go ahead and say... Structure. Door. We're gonna want to leave an opening here. Should have left that opening there in the first place. But uh, let's say trap here. Hold on. Bad guys are gonna try to come through through the entrance this way. We're gonna leave a nice big long open path this way. So if I put a trap here, then we need to be able to access it to 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 like restock it or repair it. So first trap goes here, then open space. So that means we need a door here and here. And then, like, every other. Let's start with a small amount. Let's also copy this. And we will also put a door there and here. Uh, but let's also forbid all this stuff until we're done with the rest of the wall. The Girthy and Sly are seeing eye to eye. Nice. It's pretty good, I hear. Sly's probably not in the best of mood. In a moderate amount of pain, joy deprived. I could really use a break. Well, you did miss your <laughs> your evening of throwing horseshoes due to getting <laughs> mangled by a bear. But, uh, yes, yeah, it's, it's fine. All right. What's up? So, foods. So we've got 48 pemmican. Um, it's not listing... Okay, there's the prepared field. Prepared food. Two simple meals. How quickly did these deteriorate without our ice box? Three days. Well, that's way better than one day. Yeah, cook all this stuff. Should get a couple more cooking fires or something. 
We got two people that can cook, I think. Campfire does consume fuel, though. A fueled stove would require steel. Do we have any steel? We do have some silver and a little bit of wood. We have none steel. Did we just not spawn in with steel, or did I already use it for something else? It's entirely possible that I already used it all. And now that we've established this perimeter, I do want to go zone our area. Clear allowed areas. Area 1. Excuse me, Yoshizor. What are you doing out there? That's unacceptable. You are not unrestricted. What are you talking about? Um, restrictions. Stay in area one, crazy bastard. Stay inside the safe area until we absolutely have to expand it. That's right, Girthy. Cook it up. Sly's gonna make us a, man a, a magnificent bed right now. Negative 21. Opinion of the Girthy had deep talk. Times three plus 34. Teetotaler versus chemical interest and annoying voice. Well, hey, that's good, though. Had deep talk. Like, they're they're bonding. They're bonding. It's good. Uh, looks like... The Girthy... Not getting along with too many people. He's only slightly acquainted with Sly. So, Girthy's just gonna cook the food while everyone else eats it, and he's just gonna call it good. What are you doing? Wandering? Excuse me? Yoshizor, what are you supposed to be doing right now? You like the medicine. You like the shooting. A little bit of growing and construction. Well, we grew some rice, which grows incredibly fast. We grew some potatoes. We could grow more. Uh, I believe there's some sort of, like, medicine we're supposed to grow when you start in the ancient era. Or whatever you call it. Let's do a uniform growing zone. We'll just grow some stuff. I don't know, outside somewhere. What are we going to grow here? Heel root. None of your non-downed growers have the skills so the plant will not be sown. Fantastic. So heel root's not an option. Hop plant. Time for growing hops, an essential ingredient in beer. Uh, smoke leaf. A leafy plant cultivated for psychological effects. Can be prepared into joints at a crafting spot. Oh, that's what we need. Hmm. I don't know. Takes a long time to spoil, needs fertile gro soil to grow well. Uh, fertility sensitivity is at 100%. Fertility requirement of 50%. How does that compare to... Rice. Rice is also 100% fertile. Uh, okay, so we could grow corn in the fertile area, but... I don't know, I mean... We don't want to have huge fields, I know that. Let's just, let's just not plant more then. Um... See if we can find something else for you to work on. Yoshizor, instead of hunting or constructing. Here, you can totally go do this. Go go work on one of these beds. Get to work. And actually, you know what? Honestly, if you're gonna be working, you should be working on this. No, 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 but why? But, but why would you, why would you, you, you had the, the wood was in your hands, Yoshizor! You're crazy, just, just take the wood that was already in your hands, go down there and build a wall! It's not that complicated. Jesus, man. Uh, pirate raids will start soon, yes, this is true. Uh, let's also plan out a trap, so security, deadfall trap. It's going to take a lot of wood. I'm going to manually tell it to chop that tree since it's 100% grown anyway. No, no, no. Hey, hey, where are you going? Don't go build the linkable stool. Go... Come on over here and build one of these things instead. Um... I feel a whole lot better if we could get, like, at least part of this taken care of. 
Need materials, no wood. Okay, well then chop down a tree. Deserve my taste. Crying out loud. Fighting over who gets to chop down the trees. It's just silly. Alright, cool. Well, um, I suppose now's a good time as any to take a break. I do hope that you're enjoying the campaign. I do look forward to seeing you as well in the next episode. So thank you as always for watching, and I will see you in a bit. See you soon.